New information about an FBI agent involved shooting in the Northwest Valley. Yeah, we told you last week a federal agent shot a man during a barricade situation. Fox 5 Sophia Paraconi is live at Metro headquarters with details of the moments leading up to that shooting. Sophia. Well, we now know that Matthew Beasley was shot by FBI agents after he pointed a gun at them while they were stopping by his house last Thursday. But we still don't know why federal agents were at his house in, North, in the Northwest Valley near Ann and the 215 in the first place. New documents from the FBI detail the moments leading up to a shooting in the Northwest Valley. Last Thursday, FBI agents were going to a home near Ann and the 215 to interview a man named Matthew Beasley for an ongoing investigation, an investigation that Fox 5 is still working to learn the details about. After walking through a front gate that had a ring doorbell camera on it, agents saw Beasley inside his home through the glass front door. He motioned for agents to show him their badges, and after they did, Beasley held a gun to his own head. According to the documents, one agent told Beasley to drop the gun, but instead of following those orders, he turned the gun on the agents, who then fired at him. He then barricaded himself inside his home, and during negotiations, Beasley indicated that he knew federal agents were coming to his home at some point. Beasley was eventually arrested and brought to the hospital for his injuries. Now, no agents or officers were injured, and we don't have a photo of Beasley just yet because federal agencies do not release mug shots. Again, we are still working to learn why the FBI was at his home in the first place. We will continue to keep you updated as we learn more. Reporting live, Sophia Paraconi, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.